Castro and El Toro Loco. He's got a skills win here in Pennsylvania already. Smoke coming out of the front end of that El Toro Loco Monster Jam truck.
Next attempt coming straight across the pod in a stoppy position, going for a moonwalk, but he's going to keep it right there and edge it out into a nose wheelie. This is what you love to see out of El Toro Loco. Nose to the ground, smoke coming out of the crazy bull. Rear steer, front steer, both working overtime, and he has got a good one going here, edging that front clip, just trying to shred the mouth off of El Toro Loco. It stays right there. Great move from Armando Castro and El Toro Loco. Next attempt, he comes up over the logs again into that nose wheelie position. Just going to teeter-totter this thing back and forth. Smoke again coming out. El Toro Loco Nation is out in full effect here in Wilkes-Barre, and they are loving every minute of Armando Castro. Sets it down before the 20 seconds is up. 8.824. Armando Castro style, it's time for the overall event leader, Armando Castro in El Toro Loco. He has won both competitions so far today, and to win the overall event championship, he needs to finish fourth or better here to walk away with that trophy. Armando Castro out of Whittier, California, one of the stars in Monster Jam in front of this El Toro Loco team with Elvis Linus, Jamie Garner as well. The immense popularity that Elvis and Armando have put together in the Latino community is unmatched in any sport, in my opinion, especially in motorsports. As Armando looks to continue to add to his trophy case, another freestyle win and overall event championship here would propel him into even greater heights as we get closer to World Finals 22 in Nashville. Great look there at the crazy bull front clip still hanging on there. He tried to Armando Castro, El Toro Loco, one of the best in the sport at this competition. Comes all the way across that race ramp, goes down over the pod into a nose wheelie. Smoke coming out of the nose of the crazy bull. And now Armando Castro going to work with the rear steer. Going to back this thing up into a moonwalk, trying to get all the way across the pod. Gets it down into that dip section and then back down on the other side of that ramp. Attempt step number two here for El Toro Loco. We're going to go for a popper up onto the pot into a nose wheelie. He's got it. Nicely done here by Armando Castro. Now he's got to balance the truck back and forth. A nose wheelie, moonwalk combo. Edging it out. He's got a lot of space to work with on the front end of that popper. And he's got a good one going here. 20 seconds is the amount of time he's got to keep the truck up on two wheels. He's taking full advantage of it. More smoke coming out of the nose. And Armando Castro finally lands it back on all four BKTs. 9.752. Armando Castro getting it done again. Started a little slow here, chopping away at the dirt in DC. Finally finds his groove, and El Toro Loco goes around, goes around again, and goes around some more. Armando Castro gets it done. 9.184. And that means El Toro Loco with a second win. Armando Castro taking the donut competition. Second event here in Washington, Armando was shut out of the win column the first event as that event championship went to Chris and Anderson. Now Armando cleaning up. He's won everything except for racing and trying to add another freestyle win to his already stellar resume in the early part of the 2024 Monster Champ season. He's in his eighth season riding El Toro Loco. A couple World Finals appearances thrown in there, competed in the main field for the first time last year. 2019 World Finals Speedster Racing Champion. Still looking for the first series title of his career as El Toro Loco comes off, just lands a little awkward on the sway bar. El Toro Loco now coming in hot for a backflip. First one of the night, and Armando Castro lands it into a moonwalk. You get a backflip moonwalk combo from Armando. That's got to take the lead. And he's still got a little time on the clock. Comes right up over the race ramp all the way across the pod. And try to find some more time. Give him Megalodon a little bump there. And that'll do it. Take a look at the original Super Glue. Glue to the action replay. Wonderful execution. 9.655 off the backflip. That brings us 2019 World Finals. Speedster Racing Champion Armando Castro. El Toro Loco break check. First jump big time air. Out of Whittier, California, Armando Castro fighting for a series championship. Goes up on a tire stack into a popper. Clips the back two wheels. Coming back again, goes off to the right of the race ramps and cross-threading. What I mean by cross-threading, when a driver takes their truck and hits an obstacle to the right or the left, not quite center. That means they're throwing it into chaos mode, trying to make something happen as there is a big-time sky wheelie for Armando Castro. Gets a pogo bounce to the back two wheels. El Toro Loco comes back again, this time off to the center lane, trying for a popper. 
Armando Castro now coming up over the log here, gets into the pod again, back down on all four BKT tires on the near side of this track. And El Toro Loco coming back for more. Cody Saucier has the freestyle lead. He's won two competitions so far. Armando trying to take one away from him. Here we see Dragon watching Armando Castro up on two wheels, makes the save and comes back again, trying to go all the way across the pod, get some traction here on the BKT wheels. Nice turn for Armando as he turns it hard to the right and comes right back over the pod again into that center lane and back down. Armando doing a great run here, trying to get something spectacular though. Needs a wow moment if he's gonna take the freestyle lead. And time is up. Take a look at Armando Castro up over the log stack 7.705 with a vertical sky wheelie. Just the first attempt from El Toro Loco. One more remaining. Keep it going, Armando. Those scores in now for Armando Castro, El Toro Loco. He wants to solidify this win. I think he's going to go for it. The Morgan and Morgan backflip! Pulls off the backflip. Armando Castro and El Toro Loco, hometown kid here on his home track. And here is your popper up over the median. That divider brings the wheels back into a moonwalk, stops it right there. Now we got smoke coming out of the crazy bull. Some confidence here in Armando Castro. And he's going to go right over here to that wall section of this racetrack, that big, thick median right there. Definitely a breath of fresh air for Armando Castro. He gets the truck up. He was a little bit cattywampus when he first went to set that truck, but he is walking that thing out. You can see the smoke coming out of front of El Toro Loco, pressing that button, taking a hand off the wheel. Relaxation from hometown to Armando Castro.
Now just edging it out here in nose wheelie. Moonwalk going right back. Going to flip it up. He's got a backflip. Oh, my goodness gracious. He hits the backflip. That's not even an eight-pack. That is a no-pack.